I'm Laura Thomas and I'm here at Culver Academies to check out what the Irish are up to at training camp this summer. Dwight, can you talk a little bit about the preparation that goes into providing all the meals here at camp? Okay, so we uh, take a lot of time to plan out the menu for our athletes. How much carbohydrate do they need? How much protein? How many fruits and vegetables? And uh, on top of that, we spend a lot of time educating on hydration this time of year. So we're gonna check out the barracks, see where these guys are living. Oh, wow. So this is where you stay. Yeah, it's super hot. <laughs> yeah, no AC up in here. But you got two fans right on the bed, so that's good. So we, we ordered 280 cases of Gatorade and uh, right at 200 cases of water. So if you do the math on that, you're talking uh, close to 9,000 bottles of food. You might be wondering why the Irish come down here to start out their training camp. Well, because of NCAA regulations, they aren't allowed to do two-a-days for the first five days of camp, which means a lot of extra free time. And Culver's a good place for some team bonding and some extra recreational activities as well. Brian Kelly is not the only Notre Dame coach to bring his teams down here. Lou Holtz actually brought some of his teams down here in the 90s. Let's find out how different it was back then. You know what, personally, man, it was actually my freshman and sophomore year that we came. So you know when you're young in the program, you kind of are swimming, trying to figure things out. So, uh, I mean, it was a great experience. Obviously, it's pretty nostalgic that we're, we're back here. No, there was no air conditioning. There was no, you know, it's just hot. Everywhere you went in the dorms and the meeting rooms, everywhere was hot. The upperclassmen actually went and uh, slept in the ice arena. So uh, they kind of kept that on the hush. Uh, us lower classmen, we didn't know that. So uh, we just had to deal with it. You know, we wound up taking our, our bedding and, and, and dragging it over to the ice rink and playing cards into the night and, uh, and laying down on the cement bleachers and sleeping and sleeping in, in the uh, ice rink where we could finally get some relief from the heat. It's not that much cooler in here compared to outside, but it is a little better. He said they slept on the metal bleachers here. Uh, yeah, this is, this is not very comfortable. I mean, that's what this is all about. It's, it's being away from everything else, getting together as a team. And, we had our stores in the heart of it.